With the release of the latest version of OS X Mavericks, Apple introduced something that undoubtedly will soon become the norm for web browsers, in-browser push notifications. Roost supports push notifications to Safari straight out of the box. If you have been following along with the previous episodes, we already have everything in place that we need. If not, you simply need to install the Roost.js snippet and the Roost bar from the Roost UI kit. Let's see this in action. Here I am at my website. You can see at the top we have the Roost bar. This is what will appear if you view a website using Roost in a non-push enabled browser. This is currently all major browsers except for Safari on Mavericks. Now, let's see what happens when we view my site in Safari. The first thing you'll notice is this pop-up in my browser asking if I'd like to receive push notifications. Also, the Roost bar does not appear. We detect the browser and then decide to show the bar or not based on its functionality. I'm going to say yes, allow. Now that we have chosen to receive notifications in my browser, let's see what it looks like to get one. I click on send. I'm going to send to all recipients. Enter my message. Put in my URL. and push send. Before I push send, pay attention to the top right of my screen. There it is. The notification appears in the style that I have chosen for my notifications from the notification center. It also appears here in the notification tray. When I click on this notification from either the tray or from that pop-up, it pushes me directly back to the URL that I provided. That's powerful. You can begin using Push with Safari today simply by placing the Roost.js and the Roost bar onto your site. If you have any questions, please contact us at support at roost.me. I'm Dan Stever, Developer Evangelist for Roost.